Hello everyone, we are doing another island tour and this is the island of Eden and it is a rustic old town and this is by crossing.lana on Instagram and that is L-A-N-A. -A. So here is the flag and I've already noticed that there's a bunch of walls so that is really nice and we will go ahead and start in the entrance and supernatural terraforming. So here is the entrance. Let's go ahead and look at the map. So this is Eden. There's a bunch of waterscaping, which I need inspiration for waterscaping and I need to know how to make it look natural. So, and I've seen a bunch of natural rivers so far. Hopefully that will help me. So here are the villagers. Oh my goodness, I also have Nan and Chevre. And that is so cool. I love these villagers, really, really cute. And these are the, that's the map and the villagers. And then here is the entrance. There is a structure at the top and that is so pretty up there. And there's a bunch of trees so it's a very cute little mini entrance and i love this beautiful natural terraforming and waterscaping it is beautiful and i love the diagonal bridge and then wow that is a great idea i've never thought of that to do a little mining section, a little cave. And actually it is a, a train track. Railroad, that's really nice, very creative. And a little coffee section and sitting area. That is really, really cool. It is very rustic. And this is such a cool area. It's a train station and also mining. Oh, actually, yeah. Yeah, that is a train right there. So that's a great idea to use the cave as a little train. This island is very delicate. And here we got the newspaper section. I really like how there's a mix between structured areas and natural. That is super pretty. They really know how to do structures very well, make them look really natural. And then I really like that wide train track design. So they actually did mention that this island is an old mining town. So that explains why there's a bunch of mining carts and railroads. So that is a really nice theme. And then this is a little wood chopping area. And then this is a villager's house. And they really transformed the whole beach. They put a lot of paths down and they really filled it with a bunch of structures. And this pathway of lights is really nice. And oh my god, this is like the cutest boardwalk I've ever seen. It is just so cute with all the lights and all the wood. Such a good boardwalk design. And then this is a very enchanted looking fishing um, restaurant. This is just so nice. So many details put into this. 
and this is a villager's house and a little writing area. And then a library with sitting area. Very, very nice island. I just love this boardwalk area. It is so nice. This whole beach was amazing. It is hard to decorate the beaches. And I feel like it was really cohesive with a bunch of a lot of mossy items and stone items. So that was an absolutely amazing beach. And we got a lake. And yeah, this definitely looks really natural. And I always struggle with that. It is hard. And the beautiful mailbox design. So this is a little mail station. And I really like the wagons. And just to let you guys know, I will be doing this full week of island tours. So I will be posting a bunch of island tours like every day. So if you guys are interested in that, then you guys can subscribe and just um, be on the lookout. And I like this little farming section. I always like when farms have scattered crops. So this looks really nice. And a beautiful little cabin. And we will go ahead and see the inside. Oh, this is really nice. It's so fancy. I think that this is a mail, a mailing area. It's like a little business. Wow. It is a post office, yeah. That looks so nice, it's super fancy. I would like to decorate my, my whole house with that theme. And here is a train station. So a little train stop, very, very creative. And that is really nice. This is very sophisticated. And you know what? I actually realized that that whole thing wasn't a mail, a post office. It might have been a post office, but it might have just been a whole train station. And the entrance was just like where you buy your boarding tickets. So yeah, but it was amazing. And there's a little farm outside. And here's an outdoor little eating area. And here is a house. It really blends in well with the structures. And this is a beautiful bakery. Very, very cute. Absolutely love that. And here's a little winery. 
very mini but still looks really fancy. A little tea area. And there's a secret little stairs. And there's another house and a bunch of bicycles par parked outside. Parked. Oh, I was about to say that. And this is a diner. Very, oh, wait a minute. This is her house. This is her house. Okay. And you know what? Yep. It made it look like it was a resident house because it was so big. So that is definitely a good trick to extend the villager's house. And is that Velma or what? She has a diner in her house, as her house. Excuse me, sorry. Oh, she stopped walking. Oh, she walked away from me. This is just beautiful. It's so stunning. So Nook's Cranny is in this structure. Very, very cool entrance to Nook's Cranny. And we got a library in the outside. And we got rooms. So I wonder if it's a hotel or a hospital. So these might be houses. So that is so nice. That's so creative. So that's a little bedroom. It might be a hotel. Maybe that's the front desk. I am sorry for pushing you again. And then this is Able Sisters. Beautiful dress right here. And a lot of fashion on display and sewing, laundry section. A lot of creams and white. And then this is the campsite. Very simple. I love all the plants and items that they put all around. And I like how they put a dirt path on the beach. And I also have a beach campsite. I really liked doing that and I never thought of doing it, but it really turned out really nice. But I think since I already did a beach campsite, I will be doing a very um, natural and wood, woodsy campsite. So maybe I will do like a hiking trail to get to the campsite. So I really wanted to look forest like. I hope you guys enjoy this island. Please stay tuned for my other um, island tours that I will be doing this week. And this island was absolutely breathtaking. I love this theme and I just really loved, enjoyed this tour. So if you guys also enjoyed it, then you can give it a like and subscribe to show your support. And I will be seeing you guys very soon. Thank you for hanging out with me. Goodbye. Have a great day. <laughs>